Well, that's very, very reassuring what we've seen there. That high speed drop, and now you can see from the little dot, there's the applause. David, you called it in? You said something. Kemp. Family applauding, but you can see by the little dot that he's in controlled descent. Two minute into free fall. So two minutes. Uh, keep talking, Felix. Keep talking. Still can't quite make that out, but reassuring to hear his voice. And you can see how he's in control there. That's showing you the supply of oxygen in his oxygen bottles. Yes, Felix, I hear you. Go ahead. Roger, go ahead. Go ahead, Felix, I hear you. Go ahead. I have been running on speed for a long time. I have like a half out. For some reason. I can stop speed now. I'm a laser. Still free falling. You're really stable. You've fallen three and a half minutes. Record is. I have been told before because my riser is fucking up. I repeat, my riser is fucking up. I tell. So you can understand that. He said his visor was fogging up, but he's getting to warmer altitudes. There's the shoot. There's the shoot.
So under under parachute now. Could have done it better myself. There's there's the from the helicopter out of the north now. At five to ten. Out of the north, under at five canopy, to ten, and you can contact floating Mike Todd safely on this frequency. Give Mike Todd a Floating safely down over. to earth. There's Ava Baumgartner. The winds out of the north, five to ten. Give Mike Elated. Todd a call. Tears on this of frequency. joy over. from Mission Control. As Felix now. Oh. Approaches right, uh, the ground. I hear you. The wind here are out of the east at about 10 to 15. So, so we're we're now at 6,000 feet. This is Mission Control. Felix's current altitude under the chute is 6,600 feet. Okay. Any direction? So he has the. Highest We're jump. For you, but we can't find you. Uh, the telemetry just worked. There he is. There's a closer shot. Closer shot from the helicopter. Felix, the wind's out of the north. Five to ten. Beautiful shot. Facing that big tower. Anybody can hear? I'm facing that big tower. Okay, and the wind's out of the east. I'm sorry, I gave you the wrong information. Out of the east. All your Felix, we're coming your way, bud. Carry on, my knees are Pretty good. Coaching her. Felix, wind is out of the east. The wind is out of the east. Under parachute, you have we see it. We're quite coming a, your way right now. Quite a bit of control by pulling us. Land down in some other direction. Wind's out of the east, Felix. Wind's out of the by east. By pulling the cords, he can control a fair amount of control on his path into this landing. Now we see that scrub earth below. Felix's altitude is 5,800 feet. Just 5,000 feet now, so really nearing. And the altitude out there, I'm not sure of the altitude of the ground. Hey, drop from clear, guys. Drop from target clear. Luke's making the call to drop smoke, Felix. That means to Luke's drop that east, Felix. smoke marker from one of the helicopters. Oh, he wanted to see, I see. He wanted the smoke so he could see the wind direction. Hey, Felix, the wind is coming from the ridge. The wind is coming from the ridge. No, towards the ridge. Art Sorry. Thompson, the, wind the is coming technical director the ridge. of the Red Bull Status Program, telling him that the wind is coming from the direction of that ridge I was talking about. So he certainly got the highest jump mark that he was after. We'll find out about the mock. Did he break the speed of sound as he hoped? Here he's coming. And there you can see by the approaching shadow, he's just about there, and he's down on the earth, safely back. Down on his knees, what a shot. So he has the new record. Control shows recovery crew is at uh, Felix's location. Also, Mission Control shows uh, the balloon has been cut from the capsule and the capsule is on its descent. So in there fast, he has the world's record now for the highest jump 
by far. Around 28,000 feet. So more than 24 miles up. Successful after all this training, all this work, all this time. There is the capsule being lowered. It has been cut away from the balloon. It's parachute deploying automatically, and the capsule comes down to preserve Gardner, friends, Felix Baumgartner Sr., his father, all celebrating here at Mission Control. There's the recovery helicopter very near where he landed, out to the east of Roswell. Yeah, we have unofficial word there on some of those those statistics. It was a four minute, and this was unofficial as they got it in mission control. For, for that, would not break the record for the elapsed time of the free fall. And we'll see, did he break mock? Those were speeds up in the 700 mile an hour mark. So I think that's unofficial and calculated a bit differently than the instrumentation. We'll see. That has to wait. And he broke the record, as we mentioned, for the highest manned balloon flight. So after some tense moments, the issue in flight with the visor, which was successfully resolved. Council there you have it. Descending through Aerospace history feet. has been made today. Austrian pilot and parachutist Felix Baumgartner has done it. Made Red Bull Stratus mission to the edge of space a part of the record books. A successful climax to years of careful planning and development. Along the way, there were setbacks, snags in development of the equipment, weather delays. But today, Baumgartner and the Red Bull Stratos team are celebrating, celebrating on the ground there at the scene now. More celebrations will follow here at Mission Control. So we're still awaiting final confirmation, but unofficially, new world records have been set for the highest free fall ever, the fastest free fall ever.